Hey Oregon FFA, it's Jenna here, and today we're going to be talking about social media. Over the last couple of months, we realized how truly important virtual communication is and will continue to be in the future. So today we're going to take a look at some easy ways to communicate with our chapter members and share information. To kick things off, I'm going to go ahead and share our screen so that we can take a look at it together. I have went ahead and visited canva.com in order to create some really cool templates for an Instagram post for an FFA meeting. So I went to Canva, looked through all the templates, chose one I really liked, and chose one for an Instagram post so that we can create an Instagram post advertisement for an FFA meeting. So here I have my template, and I also have some preloaded images into the Canva that we can work with today. We're gonna go ahead and start off filling in our template. First thing I'm gonna do is add kind of a welcome. Let's do join us at our October, and then we'll fill in this next big text with FFA meeting. So as students are scrolling through social media, it's super easy to read. Join us at our October FFA meeting. Big letters, big font, and it sticks out. Next, we're gonna need to identify when this meeting is and at what time, so that there's no questions about that. So at the bottom, there's some room for more text here, and we'll just go ahead and fill that in with October 23rd, 2020 at 6 p.m. Awesome, now we have that. So there's no questions about when this meeting is and what date it's on. A really awesome next part to what we can do here on Canva is add some images to our template to create some eye appeal and interest while our FFA members are scrolling through social media. So let's go ahead and add some pictures right now. I'm just adding some pictures from my old chapter, a picture of my teammates and I, and some things just to spark some interest. Once I have those pictures loaded, we're all done here with our meeting post. This is super easy to share on social media and I'll show you how to do that. We go over here to the top of Canvas page and we select share. With that, we can type in the email of our chapter president, our teammates, our advisor, anyone that we want to share this Canva with. There's also another really cool option to download our Canva, and we can select any type of file type that we want. I'm gonna go ahead and select the PNG file because it's suggested, and then hit download. And once we hit download, it'll prepare our design and download it to our computer, and we can work with it on any social media platform that we need to. With that, I can't wait to see all of your social media designs and platforms and advertisements that you use from Canva. Have a great day, everyone.